Platinum Games has a reputation for making action games that are both incredibly stylish and delightfully weird. The latest, the Switch-exclusive Astral Chain, wholeheartedly embraces this tradition and pushes each aspect to the max. This is Platinum Games at its finest. Its innovative combat system cleverly manages to make controlling two characters at once feel intuitive and deeply rewarding. Equally as impressive, the non-combat sequences charmingly bring this peculiar world and the characters who inhabit it to life. As a new recruit for the Neuron Special Task Force, your job is to rid the world of chimeras, alien invaders that can only be seen by certain people. This is where the eponymous Astral Chain comes in. It's what tethers you to a variety of robot buddies called legions in combat. While the futuristic world is full of personality and charming oddities, the fun story is slightly weakened by the fact that whether you choose to play as the male or female Howard twin, the one you play as doesn't utter a word and is mostly expressionless. Contrasted against your animated counterpart, Akira, that's a little dull. Luckily, your character oozes personality while in combat in large part because of how ridiculously fun it is to work in tandem with your robotic legions. Even though there's a wealth of moves to learn and perfect your execution on, pulling off flashy sequences only really requires the triggers. One calls your legion onto the battlefield and flings them into action to attack automatically, while the other controls your attacks with either a baton, heavy sword, or blaster gun. Astral Chain emphasizes perfect dodges with time slowing down for a moment each time you narrowly escape. The more you wallop chimeras, the more opportunities for synchronized legion attacks you'll get. But you always have to be mindful of legion energy, because if you leave them in play for too long, it'll take longer for them to recharge. This setup promotes smart, fast play. The Astral Chain comes with two cool tricks that neatly complement the combat. The Chain Jump lets you slingshot across the battlefield toward your legion for extra mobility and you can bind chimeras by encircling them, which is particularly helpful when fighting large, multi-limbed bosses. Since you gradually unlock a total of five legions with unique playstyles, combat remains fresh throughout the 20-hour campaign. Each one has its own movement speed, attack pattern, and helpful action moves. The sword can slice through defenses, the arrow lets you line up arrow volleys manually, the beast can give you a ride, you can enter the arm and control it like a mech, and the axe creates a protective dome for defense. Legions also have skill trees that include a unique ability, further adding to Legion customization. On top of that, ability codes like the flashy Cull Burst provide flair and significant stat boosts, particularly when stacked together. What the hell? Stop! Even outside of combat, Astral Chain is compelling and irresistibly quirky. Missions often start with investigations, free roam activities where you gather clues by talking to NPCs and then help them with their problems. These non-combat moments, which amount to nearly half the main campaign, don't have a ton of depth, but they do provide a welcome breather between the intense, fast-paced combat sequences. Likewise, the Iris, an Orwellian scanning device, aids you in finding new side quests and opportunities to use your legions for less violent activities. Each legion has unique skills that help you uncover items, new pathways, and complete platforming and puzzle sections. One of the coolest features in Astral Chain is Unchained Mode, a customizable difficulty setting designed for beginners. For aficionados, the ranking system favors speed, style, and damage, but it can go as far as automating all combat so that anyone can enjoy the story. And of course, after you beat a mission on standard, you unlock Ultimate Mode, which eliminates revives and ups the intensity for extra challenge and bragging rights. Couch Co-op, on the other hand, is more trouble than it's worth. One player controls the main character while the other takes hold of the legion and camera. It's just awkward and eliminates what makes the combat novel to begin with. Astral Chain is another excellent game from Platinum and one of the best action games of this generation, period. Fighting off alien invaders with a legion robot by your side proves to be even more fun than it looks, which is saying a lot. Even outside of combat, the world and its characters brim with life, other than your character, that is. 
Excellent pacing artfully balances tense action with exploration to create a deeply satisfying and charmingly quirky ride. For more, check out the opening cinematic, the first encounter with a Legion, and some S-rank boss battle gameplay. And for everything else, stick with IGN.